my dear teachers of Chisholm, where do I even begin? No words can express the love and appreciation I have all for you. I have developed an exclusive bond with all of you individually. I have learned so much from you. Sometimes I knew that my hardships with you would be a memory that I would look back on in grief and happiness because I have come a long way. You helped shape me beyond the simple person I was when I entered in grade nine. You have inspired me to improve my writing, language, and social skills. You have inspired me to look back on my precious education and realize that it is time to use what I learned to help the future of the world. This is all what it came down to. The appreciation I have for you is as big a magnitude as the geographical distance between us. Have a great summer. Take care and I will visit you without hesitation once I'm back in the country and the virus is over. Murad Sharaf. Hello everybody at Chisholm Academy, class of 2020. I'm Jan Orden. Oh, Canada, our home and native land, true patriot love in all of us command with glowing hearts we see thee rise the true nor strong and free from far and wide o oh canada we stand on guard for thee God keep our land glorious and free. Oh, Canada, we stand on guard for thee. Oh, Canada, we stand on guard for thee. Congratulations, grads of 2020. Welcome everyone to the 2020 Chisholm Academy graduation ceremony. My name is John Tollefsrud and I'm honored to be your host. The urgency of our time galvanized this community into action. We marshaled our creativity and courage to capture this day, this achievement, this journey. We have turned back a dark story, a book of invisible pages and poison ink, and written a bold new book full of light and ideas that will endure. We redesigned our classes to restore the arc of another great Chisholm Academy school year. Today is a special page for all of us, but especially for you, our valiant graduates. It is one of those pages you'll bookmark forever for it symbolizes your journey to high school or through high school. This graduation marks the end of one story and the beginning of your own new stories full of hope and promise. Join us in celebrating today and launching tomorrow. Our heartfelt congratulations to you, Chisholm Academy graduates. Now, please welcome our chief, Chisholm Academy Executive Director, Dr. Howard Bernstein. I have been the face of Chisholm Academy since the 1980s. It's a long time and there's a lot of affection, love and appreciation for the job I've been able to hold. This year, however, is special. This is not just graduation. This is graduation under extreme circumstances. I have never been so proud of all of our staff, all of our students, and all of our parents as I am today. Today is the greatest accomplishment in the history of Chisholm. 
The COVID-19 virus could bring out frustration, disappointment, depression, but what it brought out was the inside of all of us to move forward and to be successful. You all know that I like a little bit of humor. So I gotta tell you this, how many parents thought they would be paying $25,000 a year to teach their own children at home? Whew. However, you as parents stood up in a way that is truly, truly remarkable. And we thank you for that from the bottom of our heart. We also thank the parents for trusting us with your children, your prize possessions. Thank you so much. To our teaching staff, well, sorry students, but you guys did more work, longer, more extreme than any other school I know. Our teachers stood up to the challenge. They weren't hanging out, having a coffee, giving out a worksheet, and coming back to you in two weeks. They were on every day. And not just academically, but talking to you, sharing with you, listening to your concerns, and involved of all things in extracurricular activities. Remarkable. There is no way I will ever be able to express my absolute gratitude, respect, and affection for all of our teaching staff. And then there's those kids. Wow. Those kids who stood up, who attended, who completed, who contributed, you guys are just amazing. I don't know how you did it, but you did. And everyone in this organization values, appreciates, respects, cherishes the things that you have done. Well done, students. The class of 2020 will not just be remembered as the COVID class, but the class of students who took responsibility and stepped up. Of course, I'm a little disappointed that your graduation couldn't be a little more wow. But what you did is the wow. Please take a moment to think about your teachers and all the things they have done for you. And just stop for a minute and think about it and in your own mind say thank you to our staff. Take another minute students and think about your parents who support you, who love you, who put up with you and who care so deeply for you. Just stop. Just stop and look at them now. Look at them in the face and say, Mom, Dad, I love you. I appreciate what you've done. And there's nothing more important to me than our family. And parents, look at your kids and say, sometimes I need to be a cop. Sometimes I need to yell at you. Sometimes I need to put my arm around you. But I know that you understand the reason I am doing that. It's simply because I love you. The hardest job in the world, as I'm concerned, is being a parent. There is nothing more difficult, but there is nothing more exciting and more worthwhile. As we carry on with today's graduation, I obviously extend my very very best wishes to all of our graduates and say to you, come back, tell us how you're doing, and let us know about your successes. Hi everybody at Chisholm Academy.
Class of 2020, I'm Haley Wickenheiser, four-time Olympic gold medalist with Team Canada and women's hockey. And I want to give you guys a big high five, a virtual hug, and a thumbs up for your grad 2020. I know it's a virtual grad this year, not probably the grad that you expected or uh, were hoping to have, but sometimes in life things uh, happen to us that uh, we have no control over. And so um, I hope you guys are able to have a fun celebration regardless. I hope uh, you can enjoy some time with your family and friends. And now that the weather's getting nice here in Canada, uh, get outside and uh, have some fun. Um, I know you're all amazing kids. You guys uh, have been rock stars through this whole thing. And I just want you to know that I'm very proud of you. Uh, big congratulations to you all and have a great summer. See ya. We now present the 2019-2020 Overall Achievement Awards. The teachers from each grade have selected a student who has made a consistent effort and has achieved commendable results. Here are the recipients. Grade 6, Matthew Tran. Grade 7, Dylan Fullerton. Grade 8, Cole Bailey. Grade 9, Michael Tran. Grade 10, Keenan Wolf. Grade 11, Charlie Heise. Grade 12, Dylan DeRoos. Significant Strides Awards. The teachers from each division have selected a student who has shown significant improvement in a number of courses over at least two semesters. Their effort and hard work are to be commended and acknowledged. Grade 6, 7, and 8, Elementary, Evan Hurd. Grade 9 and 10, Intermediate, Thomas Babawash. Grade 11 and 12, Senior, Luke Wieland. The Chisholm Academy Athletic Award is presented to the student who reflects true sportsmanship and excellent skills in physical education. The Male Athlete Award winner is Charlie Heise. The Female Athlete Award winner is Caitlin Hales. The Chisholm Academy Class of 2020. Congratulations, this is Danny Green here. I know it's been a rough year. I know it's a rough time right now. You guys are amazing. Um, but congratulations on your graduation. You guys have done it. Uh, you guys are bigger heroes than we are. Um, you know, continue to support the Raptors, even though I'm not on it. Can continue to support the Lakers and Danny Green, if you still consider me uh, one of your f fan favorites. Uh, but congratulations, enjoy it, and have fun, and enjoy your family. Stay safe. The Chisholm Academy Spirit Award is presented to a student who has demonstrated support for Chisholm Academy its students and its staff through positive attitude and actions. Our School Spirit Award goes to Isabel Morales. The Chisholm Academy Leadership Award is presented to a graduating student who has used his or her skills and personality to demonstrate positive leadership while attending Chisholm Academy. The 2020 honoree is Jackson Malone. The Lieutenant Governor's Community Volunteer Award is presented to a Chisholm Academy graduating student for exemplary community contribution or outstanding achievement through volunteer activity. This award recognizes a volunteer among the graduating students of each of Ontario's secondary schools and pays tribute to those students who go above and beyond the minimum 40 hours. The 2020 recipient is Jackson Malone. Now please welcome the Associate Director of Chisholm Academy, Adam Bernstein, who will present the next awards. Thank you, Mr. Talsford. Chisholm Academy is blessed with artistic talent, and today we recognize excellence in art and drama. The Jeffrey Mendelssohn Performing Arts Award, named after a Chisholm graduate, is awarded to a senior student who has demonstrated a deep commitment to his or her personal learning as a performing artist over a number of years. The student also acts as an inspiration in the drama and or music club by exhibiting excellent leadership skills and positivity to fellow performers. The Jeffrey Mendelssohn Performing Arts Award goes to Sam Arnold. 
Hello, Chisholm Academy class of 2020. Brant Doherty from Pretty Little Liars here. Hi, how are you? I hope you're all doing well. Uh, first and foremost, I hope you're all staying safe and healthy with everything going on right now. But I heard you're all graduating from Chisholm Academy this year, so I wanted to say congratulations. That's incredible. You should be very, very proud of yourself. Uh, I know Chisholm Academy is. Uh, I hope you're all doing well, and I can't wait to see what you go off into the world and do next. Take care, everyone, and congrats again. The Deborah Simmons Visual Arts Award, in honor of our talented artist and dedicated teacher, is presented to a student who best exemplifies artistic excellence, hard work, and a passion to further develop technical competence with the elements and principles of design. This year's winner is Omar Chishti. Christine Williams is a Chisholm math and science teacher who passed away a few years ago. We have honored her memory and recognition of her dedication, patience, and caring attitude toward young learners. The Christine Williams Award is given to a student who has made notable breakthroughs in his or her pursuits of math and science fundamentals. This year's honoree is Mark Moritsune. Hey grads, just wanted to say congratulations. We're all so proud of you and I just wish you guys the best of luck. Hey guys. Congratulations class of 2020. I am so excited for you and all your next successes. I wish you the very, very best on your new adventures. Grade eight graduates, I'm so proud of you. I'm proud of how hard you've worked this year, especially these last few months. Be proud of yourselves and take that work ethic with yourself to high school. Grade 12 grads, it's been a challenging time, but you've persevered and you're ready for the next stage of your lives. Please don't forget us. Come visit, let us know how you're doing in the future. We'd all love to hear. To all the graduates of 2020, you've made it through COVID-19 and school, so congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. You should be so proud of yourselves. Hi, graduate class of 2020. I want you all to know how very proud I am of each and every one of you for all the work you've done, how kind you are, what amazing individuals you are. I wish you every success and joy in every aspect of your life and know that there will always be a piece of you in my heart. Congratulations, well done. Congratulations, graduates. Be safe, be smart, and have fun. Seniors, congratulations on all the hard work you've done. Now it's time to go out and make your mark. Hey, 2020 grads, all the best in the future. Good luck, congratulations. And always remember, Chisholm is always home for you guys. Come visit us. The Chisholm Academy Citizenship Award is presented to a student who has represented Chisholm Academy through positive contributions in the community. Our Citizenship Award this year goes to Tristan Smith. The Governor General's Bronze Medal is awarded to the graduating student with the highest academic average in grade 11 and 12 courses as listed on the student's official transcript. This year's award goes to Sam Arnold. The Janet Sabaris Award is presented to a graduating student who has consistently been positive, compassionate, and sincere. This is the highest honor presented to any student at Chisholm Academy. Please welcome Dr. Bernstein, who will say a few words. Hello again, everyone. I can remember that the first time I cried in public was when I gave this award. Sometimes I still do, sometimes I weep inside, but this is an incredibly important award. This is the Janet Sabaris Award. Janet was a remarkable young woman who passed away in her early 20s as the result of an automobile accident. She was the daughter of one of my dearest friends. She was born with a serious heart condition 
and a learning disability and spent many weeks in sick kids and struggled to be successful and ultimately became a preschool teacher. She was good at it. The kids followed her around like the Pied Piper. And tragically, she died in an automobile accident. I was asked by my friends to prepare for her funeral and help them decide when it was time to end her life. It affected me dearly and deeply. To this day, I think of the sadness I feel inside, but I also think of the awesome determination of someone like Janet Severus. So when Mr. Tollisford says that it's our ultimate, most important award, it is. It's not an academic award. It's an award for being a fine, wonderful human being. It's never easy to pick a winner for this award. But this year, a young man who began here feeling quite uncomfortable about himself, grew from a little nothing to a huge something. Ladies and gentlemen, the Janet Severus Memorial Award, I am so proud to present to Murad Sharaf. Hello, Chisholm Academy families. It's me, Deborah. Surprise! For I just want to say congratulations to all of the 2020 graduates. What an accomplishment. I know that this is probably not the way that you had envisioned graduation, but uh, it doesn't take anything away from the import of that accomplishment. And this is a specific thank you to all of you families, all the parents and caretakers for your commitment and compassion and love and dedication. You all make it happen together and you are also appreciated. So from me to you, congratulations. Vice Principal Shahid will now address the Chisholm Academy Grade 8 Class of 2020. Hi guys, it's Ms. Shahid here. I believe a congratulations are in order for Chisholm Academy's Grade 8 Class of 2020. I would like to begin by congratulating each and every one of you for overcoming the exceptional circumstances of this year. It's definitely been a whirlwind. I hope you recognize what an amazing accomplishment it is to have arrived at the crossroads between elementary and high school. As a class, you've shown us humor, creativity, and wonderful spirit. While this chapter in your life closes, take some time to reflect on how much you've grown into remarkable people. With support from the Chisholm faculty, your parents, and your friends, you've reached a milestone. But it's with your own dedication that you've overcome different obstacles to make it to this point. Be proud of your accomplishments, and I hope you bring the same mindset to high school. During the next four years, you will learn many new and fascinating things. You'll develop strong friendships, explore interests, and most importantly, begin to understand what makes you uniquely individual. Soak in every moment because it's going to fly by. I wish you all the best in your next academic chapter and personal endeavors. Celebrate this achievement and have a well-earned and safe summer. With that, I have the honor of introducing this year's phenomenal grade eight valedictorian. Ruben has been a consistently high achieving student who juggles in school and after school extracurriculars like a champ. He's always kind and willing to help. I cannot think of a better suited individual to represent the core values of Chisholm Academy. Thank you. Greeting parents, Chisholm Academy staff, and my fellow grade eight graduates. 
If I were to put this grade 8 year into one statement, it would be just keep swimming. However, these past couple of months have been kind of crazy. That, but that doesn't take away from the amazing memories I have made over the past two years at Chisholm Academy. First off, I'd like to start with some notable class events. It's pretty hard to ignore an entire grade group of 18 new teenage boys. Thank you to our teachers for putting up with us. Especially Mr. K, who coped by sharing tons of dad jokes. Or Miss Spence, who sang her way through lessons. Mr. Pommier helped us get our energy out by having us chucks balls at each other. Chook ball and dodgeball. And thank you to our English teachers, who seem to have a fascination with dystopian novels. Were they warning us? And finally, thank you to our math teachers, Miss Higgins and Miss Turef. Sorry I didn't really like graphs that much. To get through a day at Chisholm Academy, you have to laugh. Starting off with the Adam C. Dance, which seems to have a pretty big following now. We may have taken the OK Boomer meme to the next level. Sorry, parents. And Miles, we always appreciate your comedic relief. Also, the macabre humor pro provided by Finley. It was always a great time when we had, when free time led to an impromptu Smash Bros tournament brought on by Jordan's contraband switch. I'd like to thank our parents for getting us to this point, our teachers for always having our backs, our principal, Miss Moisekos, and finally Dr. B. Oh wait, also the office team for nourishing our souls with candy. We couldn't have done any of this without you. Finally, I'd like to leave you with some words of advice. First off, wash your hands. Next, remember to enjoy yourself in high school, but focus on your academic courses. And make sure to take advantage of all extracurriculars inside school and outside school. This is Ruben Mahal and Zofjean, signing off. Remember, just keep swimming. Please welcome Vice Principal Schnarr to recognize the grade eight graduates. Ali Almas. Paul Bailey Travis Christie Adam Chipperoni Mitchell Cordo Gabriel Crescenza Miles Critchlow Carter Ellis Findlay Frazier Jordan Green Connor Hughes Nicholas Malbuff Ruben Mulholland Zofchin Adam Murray Jack O'Toole
Justin Roker. Joshua Stevenson. Jeremy Weirwa. Congratulations, everyone. All the best as you move forward into your next stage of life. Chisholm graduates, continue to work hard, be kind, and take pride in all that you do. Best of luck in your future endeavors. Yes, you did it! You made it! You got through it! We are so happy for you guys. Congratulations. This is an incredible day. Yeah, I feel so honored to be able to celebrate this with you, even online. Um, I'm so happy that you've made it. Um, I'm so happy that we get to celebrate you like this. Um, you deserve it. You've worked so hard. This is an amazing, really special group of grads who are so caring and committed not only to each other, but to our whole school community and to our local and global communities. You guys have contributed so much to improving things. And um, I really cherish the time that we've spent together and the many jokes that we've shared. Um, I can't wait to hear about what you're gonna do next. And I hope you guys will stay in touch with us and uh, tell us a little bit about where you're going and what, what you're doing next. Thank you. This is your day, Chisholm graduates. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. You guys have done amazing with every challenge that has come this semester. Really proud of you guys. Congratulations um, and have a great summer. Enjoy it, relax, you guys deserve it. This year, especially this semester, has been a challenge, but you got through it. I am certain that each and every one of you will be successful in whatever you put your mind to in the future. Remember to always work hard and never give up. Congratulations. Hi grads of 2020. I'm so proud of you all. I miss you. I love you. Congratulations. Congratulations graduates of 2020. Please allow me this opportunity to wish you every success in the future. Hello, teachers and staff of Chisholm Academy. <laughs> Surprise, it's me, yes. Nope, it's not Ashton Kutcher. It's me, Brian Baumgartner here, and I just wanted to say thank you. Yep, thank you for all of the work that you do serving these particular students and their needs. God bless you and good luck as you continue, hopefully not in virtual learning mode anymore. Uh, Adam, Adam Bernstein is the one who wanted me to reach out to all of you and a special hi from me to Janine. <laughs> hi, hi Janine, <laughs> hi. It was awkward for both of us. Anyway, Chisholm, thank you. Everybody loves you and good luck this summer and into next year. Nice. Principal Moisekos will now speak to the Chisholm Academy Grade 12 Class of 2020. Welcome to our graduation ceremony. As Chisholm Academy's principal, I am honored to address our Grade 12 graduates today as they embark on the next chapter in their lives. This has been a very unique and eventful year filled with inspiration and challenge and a true example of resilience, community, and growth. There were many highlights at Chisholm Academy this year and I'm so proud of all that our staff and students have accomplished together. We applaud all of our students, but particularly our graduates today for all of their efforts as witnessed through their academic achievements, their support and respect for each other, and their extensive involvement in the school's many clubs, sports, performances, charity initiatives, and many other special events. The onset of the COVID-19 pandemic around March break brought forth a new set of unexpected challenges, 
Staff and students were unable to return to school and our trips to Ottawa and Italy were sadly cancelled. And it certainly wasn't the school ending that our grade 12 graduates were hoping for in their final year. But Chisholm Academy quickly reorganized and was the first out the door with online learning and video conferencing. Staff immediately reorganized their lesson delivery to connect with all their students through Google Meet, Classroom and Hangouts, as well as additional apps. Despite adversity, our students quickly adapted to their virtual classrooms, happy to connect with their peers, participating and completing their work in a responsible, mature and productive manner. And as everyone's comfort level increased, our Chisholm community again rose to the challenge by participating in a number of online extracurricular and spirit day activities to ensure that everyone could stay connected socially. All of these accomplishments are true examples of our school's ability to manage their daily responsibilities, grow as opportunities present themselves, and cope with any challenges that come their way. Our students' resilience was tested daily, and with support from each other, they were able to succeed in fulfilling their academic goals. My advice to our grade 12 graduating class of 2020 is to never underestimate yourselves. Only you can define who you will become. Think of what makes you special, of your talents, your relationships, and of your hopes, dreams, and aspirations. School is only one part of who you are as a whole, but it is an important part in helping you get to where you want to be in life. As you embark on the next chapter of your lives as Chisholm Academy graduates, always follow your dreams and create a plan to help you get there. Set achievable goals and accept the support of those around you. Take advantage of the opportunities presented to you. Work hard to overcome the challenges and obstacles with which you are faced and strive for excellence to fulfill your dreams. And throughout this process, you will continue to grow and become a stronger, more resilient person. I would like to share one final thought with you today. During a recent virtual commencement speech for the class of 2020, Barack Obama said, ground yourselves in values that last, like honesty, hard work, responsibility, fairness, generosity, and respect for others, and build a community as no one does big things by themselves. Sounds a lot like Chisholm Academy. In closing, I would like to wish our grade 12 graduating class much happiness and success in their future endeavors. Thank you to all of our graduates, their families and friends for joining us today. And now we bring to you our grade 12 valedictorian for the class of 2020, Samuel Arnold. Hello, my fellow students, teachers, parents and families. More than anything, I wish we could all be together to celebrate this special day. I miss you all. We have definitely been through a lot together. These past four years at Chisholm have been one crazy ride, but these last few months have been something no one could have predicted. It's given me a lot of time to think about how to say a last goodbye to this amazing school. If I had to sum up what Chisholm has been to me, I would say it has been a place of life-changing experiences that will be with me forever. But what I'll remember most are the people, the amazing teachers, and the awesome friendships. Let's start at the very top. Miss Stansfield, who is the real boss at Chisholm Academy, and just in my opinion, the nicest person ever. <laughs> then there's the amazing Mr. Mooney, who put me on his basketball team and cheered the loudest when I scored that awesome three pointer. I did not see that coming. I'm sure we'll all remember Mr. T and Miss M for their unfailing kindness and patience. Miss Edmonds, shout out to baby Mackenzie, for being our best cheerleader. And Miss Simmons for her wonderful art classes. Thank you, Miss Shahid, for making us believe we could do anything. Thank you, Miss Gilbert, for teaching me how to make friends. Thank you, Mr. K and Miss Lakin, for putting me on stage. And Miss Farron for believing I could be anything from a crazy doctor to a photographer with dementia to a dead guy. I love those days in the drama room and I wish we had gotten one more chance to put on a show together. I want to thank all the teachers at Chisholm Academy, as well as Dr. Bernstein, Mr. Bernstein, Ms. Wysakos, 
Mr. Leonard and Ms. Belford for everything they've done for us. And of course, Ms. Stansfield, who should always be mentioned as many times as possible in every speech. But of course, the people I will remember most are my classmates. To Thomas and Jackson, Dylan and Alex, to Omar, Nick, Sean, and Cody, to Mark and Murad, to Brandon, Luke, and Julian, to my worthy chess rival, Tristan, and to my best friend, Isabel Morales, the only girl who could have put up with all of us. Thank you for being the best classmates a guy could ask for. We should also say a big thank you to our families for supporting us. I'd like to thank my parents, two brothers, and my grandparents for giving me the opportunity to go to this incredible school. I wanted this last year to be memorable, but this is not exactly what I had in mind. Part of the journey is the end, and though we didn't get the ending we wanted, if you think about it, it's the days we had together that mean the most. One of my favorite TV shows is The Office. And in the series finale, one of the characters says, I wish there was a way to know you're in the good old days before you've actually left them. As for me, I always knew these were the good old days, thanks to all of you. Good luck, everyone. I hope we see each other soon. I hope wherever you go next year and beyond, you hold on to the happy memories of this special place. So today, Chisholm Academy, I leave you with one final gesture. I tip my hat to you. I love you all 3000! We now recognize the secondary school class of 2020. Thomas Adamopoulos. Cody Allen. Sam Arnold. Nick Barlow. Omar Chishti. Alex Crimble. Dylan DeRoos. Sean Hunt. Joey Lasher. Jackson Malone. Isabel Morales. Mark Mototsune. Brandon Roker.
Murad Sharaf. Tristan Smith. Luke Whelan. Congratulations, you did it! Hey class of 2020, congratulations and wish you the best for everything else. Good luck! Hey Chisholm graduates, Miss Edmonds here and Mackenzie wanting to wish you guys congratulations on graduation. All the best. Congratulations class of 2020, wishing you all the best. Hope that you achieve all of your goals and we're going to miss you here at Chisholm. Good luck. Congratulations uh, class of 2020, grade 8, grade 12. Uh, you made it. This is one of the craziest school years I think you'll ever experience and you did it and you made it through and you graduated and I'm very proud of all of you and I wish you nothing but the best uh, in later years high school and anything post-secondary or workforce or wherever your heart desires to go and takes you so all the best and uh, keep in touch congratulations again congratulations Chisholm grads you guys did it wishing you all the best Chisholm Academy class of 2020 congratulations you made it despite all of the challenges you had to face this year. Hey guys, I'm unbelievably proud of you. Uh, happy graduation. I feel there's a certain amount of electricity in the air. You've blown me away, class of 2020. Each year, Chisholm Academy recognizes Ontario scholars students who have earned an average of 80% in six or more of their grade 12 courses. The 2020 Ontario Scholars Award recipients are Sam Arnold, Dylan DeRoos, Murad Sharaf, Tristan Smith, and Luke Wieland. Dr. Bernstein, please do us the honor of closing our ceremony today. Well, this is the end of graduation, but it's just the beginning of a new time for you. We thank you for placing your trust in us, for allowing us to give that little extra help to be part of the journey of your life, the life of our students, the life of their parents. We truly, truly value this opportunity. So now as you start on your new journey, you will experience some successes, some failures, some love, some disappointment, some adversity, and a whole lot of accomplishments. Welcome to being a human being. To the class of 2020, hurrah, hurrah. Feel the rain on your skin, no one else can feel it for you, only you can let it in, no one else, no one else can speak the words on your lips, drench yourself in words unspoken, live your life with arms wide open, today is where your book begins, the rest is still unwritten. Staring at the blank page before you Open up the dirty window Let the sun illuminate the words that You cannot find reaching For something in the distance So close you can almost taste it Release your inhibitions Hey, this is Natasha Bedingfield. Congratulations, this is your year Look, this is a, a weird, really weird time to graduate, but 
you know, you have got through so much adversity. You know, I know that this is a charity and a school for students with all sorts of challenges, um, but you have proven that you can get through that and that you can graduate. And um, don't let anything take away from your victory because it's a huge, big deal to graduate. This is your year, this is your time. And if you can do this, you can do anything. Uh, I want to say that you're amazing kids and that I'm doing this for my friend Adam Bernstein. He says a big hi to you all. And um, yeah, congratulations, everyone.